What's up friends, welcome into the video, and welcome in to a wild axe you spawn, which I had no idea these things could even spawn in the wild anymore, but that's kind of cool, that's going to get a pineapple berry, because that is a super rare spawn, and to kick things off in this video, we're about to do 5 Schmirgle Shiny Check, because that is quite possibly one of the rarest shiny Pokemon in Pokemon Go, and say hello to Shiny nope. Schmirgle. dang it. Check number 1, not going to be a shiny. Shiny Schmirgle. Number 2, not going to be the shiny, and Shiny Check. Number three. Hi. That's a Burmy, and it's not gonna be shiny. Shiny check number three. Not gonna be a shiny. And Schmirgle number nope. four. Not gonna be a shiny either. One more to go. And the final Schmirgle check of the video. Will it be shiny? No. But I'm not too upset that I didn't get the nope. shiny here. I'll show you guys why. And the whole reason why I'm not upset about getting a shiny Schmirgle on camera right now is because I literally have four of them. One of the rarest shiny Pokemon in all of Pokemon Go because it usually only comes around once a year. Usually, maybe twice. Which, by the way, if you haven't done your encounters, you can get it until, I believe, the 14th. So do your five encounters every single day. It's at 1 in 64 odds. Get your shiny Schmirgle. And I literally got one on day one. It was the last one of the day, I believe. It was a Attempt number five. Yeah, you can see 3 8 20, 23, Shiny Schmirgle number four. And to say that my old roommate Zach was a little upset that I got it is a bit of an understatement because he can never manage to get one of these. And now I have four. And like usual, we're gonna light the daily incense and we're gonna be talking about a few things. I'm sure you guys can tell by the gyms back there on my screen that tomorrow, March 11th, is Reggie Draco Elite Raid Day. And I'm super excited about that because that will be the first time I'm actually able to do elite raids because I'm meeting up with a group of people that I played with at Hoenn Tour to go out and do these elite raids, which one of them has a golden lure, so I'm super excited about that. And first check's gonna be a Burby, not gonna be a shiny. Next month, sometime in April, I don't know the exact date, I'll throw it up on screen because I don't know off the top of my head and I don't want to check because I'm doing the daily incense, but sometime in April, it will be Reggie Lecky elite raid day because obviously we're getting Reggie Draco now. Next one should be Reggie Lecky. Honestly, that's what the leaks say and that's just kind of what I'm assuming and honestly hold me to it if I'm wrong I'll delete my channel just straight up if I'm wrong if it's not Reggie Lucky next month in the elite raids I'll delete my channel and we get a Rimmerade shiny no sand cloak bear me shiny I can't tell you can't tell it's not shiny and obviously the things I said about deleting my channel earlier I'm not a hundred percent serious about that I'm not deleting my channel I've come too far even though I did just hit 700 subs thank y'all by the way for subbing and if this is your first time watching one of my videos Welcome. You should totally hit that subscribe button. But I'm just really confident that the next Elite Raids are going to be Reggie Lecky just because Reggie Draco and Reggie Lecky both came in at the same time in Pokemon Sword and Shield. And also the fact that that's what the leaks say. So that's just what I'm going off of and what I'm telling you guys. I'm not a credible source. Actually, I'm pretty credible. Just don't believe everything I say. All right. Boizel. But for tomorrow's Elite Raids, be expecting a video because I'm probably going to be out the entire day trying to do these Elite Raids. And I'm hoping to at least do one or two. It just really depends on the amount of people that actually show up. And we got a Chimeco check. Not gonna be shiny, but these things are really good Stardust. Yeah, thousand Stardust for catching a Chimeco. I will take that all day, every day. Nose pass. We got a shiny one during Hoenn Tour. Check out that video. Link in the description. Crabby. Going back on Reggie Draco, I feel like he won't really have much of a use, to be honest, except for maybe some PvE, since he is a dragon type, and it's a lot of dragon types in the game. I don't think he's gonna be very good at PvE because I don't think his CP gets very high. Also, Wingle shiny. Nope. Dang it. Can you guys tell I have ADHD? I'm pretty sure I do. But yeah, I don't think it's going to be very useful. It's still a really cool Pokemon. It's one of my favorite Reggies, to be honest. So I'm really excited to see it come to Pokemon Go, but I'm a little bit upset that they gave it the Elite Raid treatment. I don't think it belongs in Elite Raids, just personally. Expect a video on Reggie Draco at some point tomorrow. Wobbuffet, female. So as you guys can see, we did finish our daily incense. I believe I caught more than 16. I did speed catch a few of them. Obviously, you guys didn't see a whole lot of them because Honestly, we didn't get anything too exciting. Really, no shinies, no Galarian birds, nothing even remotely rare. Not even a second stage evolution through the entire thing. Wild, kind of sucks. And one thing that I've been waiting to do until I could get out and record is to catch my Pokedex Bruxish. Today is actually Friday, so it's literally been released for two and a half days, and I haven't been able to get out and record for you guys, so I've been avoiding catching this thing just so I could get the Pokedex entry for you guys on camera. So there we go, Bruxish. Bruxish is caught and ends the Pokedex 
it goes. Bruxish is actually probably one of the most hated and ugliest Pokemon voted in the Pokemon community, which is fully understandable in all honesty. And real quick, we actually just got invited to a Ho-Oh raid, so we're hopping in there and doing that real quick. Maybe we can actually get the shiny live on camera, because that's a 1 in 20 chance right there. No idea what the hundo is in all honesty, but hey, we'll find out whenever we catch this thing, or it decides to run away and I go check Twitter later to see what the CP hundo is. And we're going to do one more quick raid after we're done with this raid, but it's not going to be a Ho-Oh this time. And there we go, friends. Ho-Oh goes down. No idea what the CP was because I wasn't really looking. And we got Final Strike. Awesome. 15 balls. Shot. You thought not a shiny 2163 think this one might be good we'll find out so i didn't catch it 2163 ho -oh. but granted i did check the cps and it wasn't any good so it's probably just mid at best because the hundo i believe is 2203 so really i ain't too upset but granted the candy would have been nice but it is time to finally do mega metacham which i'm so excited for this one because i have a hundo and i have a shiny but you'll have to stay tuned for a little bit longer to see which one we actually actually mega evolve and there we go friends mega metacham goes down honestly i'm probably not going to get the shiny because the odds are one in 64 so the odds of us getting a shiny is very slim to none either way 200 energy nine balls shiny metacham Oh, that would've been crazy. 992, weather boosted. No idea if it's any good, but we'll find out in just a second if we potentially got a second hundo. Is the 992 Metacham any good? It is, I mean, subpar, but it definitely ain't the best. It ain't, it ain't gonna be kept, that's all I can say. But honestly, guys, who am I kidding? I'm gonna be Mega Evolving this beautiful, shiny Metacham into shiny Mega Metacham for the Pokedex entry, because come on, look at it. It is amazing. Like I said, I love the blue shinies, and look at that, a blue blue shiny mega metacham into the pokedex which honestly this isn't good at all but hey it's not like it's going to be that useful at all besides for candy anyway which i'll probably mega evolve the perfect one at some point in the future as well but honestly you guys probably won't see that because it's already been put into the pokedex so eh, doesn't really matter also i do want to say i'm sorry if it seemed like i was kind of like rambling and all over the place today i kind of came into this video with the plan but when i got to the park that i play out and there were just so many people People here it kind of made it a little bit hard because I still don't like recording around people because it, I'm awkward and don't want people to stare at me <laughs> honestly so I apologize for that but be on the lookout for Reggie Draco elite raid day video that should be posted tomorrow Saturday night hopefully if I can get it edited in time but either way if you guys made it this far in the video thank you so much for watching I really do appreciate it be sure to like comment subscribe all those good things let me know if you're excited for Reggie Draco raid day tomorrow and if you're gonna do them but either way i'll catch you guys in that video and i'll see you guys next time peace